Hola. Tis I, Alicia, how are you? I hope you're doing good, as good as can be, for today. Alrighty, so, what I wanted to look at, one of you lovelies, you know who you are, you sent in this idea for a reading, and I thought, well, that's kind of interesting, uh, about doppelgangers. Really? Doppelgangers. Now, the doppelganger, this is what it said, is when I looked it up, what the official type of definition for such a phenomenon is, is a mysterious exact double of a living person. Okay, so I know we've all seen doppelgangers, and it's kind of crazy when we see them. I don't know if it's the same as, like, you know, when people say, like, Oh, what's that lady I look like that has the big forehead? Andy McDowell. People are like, oh my gosh, you look like Andy McDowell. And I'm like, thanks. Okay, so <laughs> I'm not saying she's not beautiful, but I, I think it's just because I have the five head. Okay, so whatever. Anyhow, let's go in and see what we can find out about the doppelgangers. All right, so first question, are doppelgangers a real thing? Maybe it's just, you know random and we're just seeing things you know kind of like all those mandela effects that you know who knows but let's see doppelgangers are they a real thing Uh, ha, 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 oh, ho, ho. Good old sneaky snacker popped up. Let's pay our sneaky snacker tax. Sneaky snacker in the reverse. Okay, so this would say that yes, they are a real thing, but it's El Diablo over here is making me think something here. Okay, so the underlying energy is like, you've been caught, right? Sneaky snackers not getting away with shit anymore. It's like, oh, I've been caught. But that would almost lead me to think that almost everyone has a doppelganger. Almost like you've you might find one and when you find one I don't know what we're talking about here but I'm gonna get some more fries with that it's like a it feels like it's almost a direct opposite of you in a way now that's weird too this is almost like, yes, there's doppelgangers, and when you see one, then that's it. Now, that, I think that's one of those uh, myths around it, right? Like, uh, if you see your doppelganger, then you're going to be voted off the um, earth. You get my drift? Okay. This is interesting. This is almost like... I don't know. This doesn't feel like this is just a natural occurrence like that would happen out of the blue. This feels like there's something El Diablo about this, that this is done on purpose. God, the levels of how this would even work, don't ask me. The way it comes through is that there was a plan to seed doppelgangers here there was a weird plan this okay i know i i feel like where's my hat where's my hat i've got to get my hat on because this is just going this just went to crazy town too quick oh my hat okay i'm like trying to get it on my head so i don't look all derpy trucker okay this is almost like a there's a good part 
and a bad part. So there's one doppelganger, one dop I don't know. There's one, one, right? And here's the doppelgangers together. One is created as like a good one and one's created as one who could tend to go bad, right? It's almost as if though they were placed in order to frame you if you were needing to be framed for something. That's weird. So who would do this? Who would do th this? is so weird. So, oh, yeah, it's, it's, overall, there's a big goal to, a big plan with this. So it's not like accidental. And it's almost like when plans fall apart, the other one can be popped up. Okay, now this is just too, this is too Looney Tunes, even for me. Time for a little crystal chit chat. Chit -chat. Okay, so yeah, rose quartz. I think this is probably the perfect stone for this reading. It's a stone of love that transcends space and time and it draws love to you like a universal magnet. And in case you ever run into your doppelganger and you need a little dose of protection, maybe this can help you out in those times. So stay tuned to the end of the video because you're going to know what I mean. But if you want to get yourself some rose quartz, you can head over to my website, aliciawicker.com, and get yourself some tumbled rose quartz. All right, let's see. Um, let's get into, see if we can ask the question more directly, why do they exist? Underlying energy is two of wands in reverse. Again, it's so weird. There's like a, if, and the cards are saying that they exist, this would be also saying that this is a plan that's ending. Okay. I'll put that one over here. It's a plan that's ending. There's that guy again. Oh, shit. What the? You saw me shuffle the cards. Okay. So what I'm seeing here is that this was some type of plan by, I don't know if this is El Diablo or I don't know who it's an El Diablo type. No bueno group. I don't know who they are. Part of me wants to say aliens, but I don't, I don't know. Cause this is like blowing my mind. This is like, Doppelgangers are created. Someone wanted to do this, like controlling, play. it's like an experiment. Like this is an experiment out there. The, and it's like, so to, and I don't know if all doppelgangers are like either all the way right? Maybe there's doppelgangers and people are like, oh, this person's nice too. But it's almost the intent was that there would be a good one and a bad one. And that if they needed to, they would activate the bad one. And then it would put the good one in some type of jeopardy. And it's almost too here. This is like, so say for the, the bad one, it's almost like, there's some key element that they didn't have in place to just make them automatically no bueno. It didn't work like they intended. So the intent was there, but somehow maybe people's own souls are like, no, I don't want to be bad. I don't want to do horrible things. Um, but again, it looks like it, this plan stopped. But this is like what they're trying to do. How 
weird. Okay. This just, okay. It would be weird too because you think about, at least I think, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Tell me in the comments. Like a lot of times your supposed doppelganger is like on the other side of the world. <laughs> I don't know. This is blowing my mind. Okay. Does everyone have a doppelganger? Let's ask that. Does everyone have a doppelganger? Oh my gosh. I can't even imagine what mine would be. Mine's probably nicer than I am. Mine's probably like doing all these wonderful things around the world and I'm over here being snarky. Okay. Does everyone have a doppelganger? Hmm. Doesn't look like it. Okay, so it doesn't look like everyone has a doppelganger. It's almost like couldn't fulfill the plans to do that. Wanted to do that, but didn't have the resource, couldn't do it, didn't have the resources to make that plan happen. Although it was a dream. I cannot believe these people. Okay, so there was a dream that everybody would have one, but they couldn't do that. Okay. Let's see if we can just get any closer. Who is behind doppelgangers? Is it aliens? Is it governments? Is it uh, El Diablo? Is it uh, Jack in the Box? I don't know. Let's see. Who, who is behind doppelgangers? The creation of them. That's interesting. <clears throat> I'm asking who is behind this and all I get is it's over. Don't worry about it. It's over. Don't worry about it. Like <sighs> they, they had a hard time executing their plan. We're going back to old times where this kind of stuff doesn't happen anymore. They had a big plan and they're worried because it's not going because it's dead in the water. It's just, they, they were, it's like, they're sad. There's information coming out about it, which is weird. I wonder if this is somehow like related to cloning. Uh, but there, it's just sad. It's almost like who's behind it. There's a lot of people at play doing this together, but essentially don't worry about it. This, it's like a, program that's been ended so we are not to know we are not to know well aye 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 all right so let's ask this then let's finish this off the the doppelgangers that were created to be no bueno what's their life path busy. It's almost like their life path is now freedom. So whatever this plan was and it didn't materialize, they're, they're, they're 
going to be free and have their own free will, make pick plans for the future, to go back to old days where other weird shit's not influencing them because secrets are to be revealed about this. Finding out that this was like some weird evil plan. Hmm. All right. I'm just, last, last question, I swear, last, last question. If you find that you come into contact or see your, your <laughs> doppelganger, does that mean you're going to be now um, passing away to the other side soon? All right, let's see. Okay, so if it was me, I I don't know how you would avoid this. I don't know how you would avoid this. Um, steer clear if you f think you even see one. I don't know how you could avoid it, though. Essentially, this is all saying that, yeah, you could be voted off Earth if you come into contact with one of yours. I don't know what that is. That's It's just like... Because they're already out there, there's some type of thing that goes on, don't know, that makes it so the, and I'm assuming you guys are all good people, uh, apparently your evil one's out there on the loose, so don't ever come into contact with your evil one because uh, things go haywire, they go no bueno, um, and it's like, bum, 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 bum. Like you're starting over. Like that means you're going back. So yeah, you're getting voted off of the earth if you come into contact with yours. Like the, the no bueno one survives and... Okay. I don't know. I don't know how you're going to avoid that. Okay. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. This turned out super crazy nutso, but I'm so glad one of you lovelies wanted to find out because... I had no idea. So with that, thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a like if you haven't already, and I will see you next time. Adios.